In addition to claiming that Crown the Euros will be the driving force in Lamborghini's planned expansion over the next few years, its Santagata Bolognese factory will produce the Euros alongside the Aventador and the Urocan, and the company is in the process of nearly doubling the facility's floor space to about 1,615,000 square feet. More than 150 assembly line workers and technicians were hired in January 2016 in anticipation of the Euros, and the factory expects to add another 500 staff members as production ramps up. The factory pumped out a record 3,400 57 Aventadors and Hurricanes last year, and Lambo looks to add 1,000 units of its SUV in its first year and 3,500 by 2019, doubling total output. Lamborghini's spiritual successor to the wild LM002 Rambo Lambo of the late 1980s, the four-seat Urus isn't named for a Spanish fighting bull like most models in the exotic carmaker's history, but rather for a historical relative of modern domesticated cattle as the most domestic-oriented Lamborghini model. This makes sense.